and welcome back to another edition of To Read or Not To Read. Today we're going to talk about beach reads, summer reads, which I feel like traditionally have been sort of light, fluffy, gossipy, but after Gone Girl and Girl on the Train a couple summers ago, I think psychological thrillers have definitely come to take their place among the beach reads. I'm going to start out with Alyssa Cole's When No One Was Watching takes place in a beautiful Brooklyn neighborhood, when all of a sudden everyone seems to be moving. Or are they? This is a definite psychological thriller with a side of social justice and just a hint of romance. I can't give too much away because... Spoilers. But let me just tell you, this one is a wild ride. Next up, J.P. Delaney's Playing Nice. It's every parent's worst nightmare. There's a knock at the door. You go to open the door, someone tells you they're here to talk to you about your kid. But what if he's not your child? The parents in this book start to do a little bit of investigation, find out some suspicious things going on at the hospital, which also leads to some suspicious information about who is on their doorstep. In true Delaney fashion, you don't know what the ending is going to be. All you know is, you can't trust anyone. Next up, we're going to take a look at Saving Grace by Debbie Babbitt. It seems odd to say, but this one is even a little bit darker, a little bit scarier. Say you're a female sheriff in a small rural town. You think you've put all of your demons, all of your childhood trauma behind you. Or have you? There was the disappearance of a sixth grader when our sheriff was a young girl in elementary school, and now it's happening all over again. And that type of trauma is definitely gonna lay bare every single secret in this small rural town. And finally, we're gonna talk about S.F. Kosa's The Quiet Girl. This one's a little different than most of the other psychological thrillers because it's gonna start out with dueling storylines. So you've got two characters that you're following along whose storylines appear to have nothing in common. Or do they? Those storylines will combine. Not before taking the reader on a roller coaster ride through suspicious characters, traumatic memories, and untrustworthy situations. Plus, the coolest thing about The Quiet Girl, it's part of something called the Big Library Read, which means starting on June 28th, if you choose to read that in ebook form on Overdrive or Libby, you will not have to wait for your copy. No hold lists. You'll be able to have it right away. Might be a good one to, uh, I don't know, use on your summer reading bookmark to tell us what you're reading so you can be entered in a weekly drawing here at Rapid City Public Library. If you have any questions about the Big Summer Read or about our summer reading program, please give us a call and we'll be happy to answer all your questions. Thanks for joining us for another To Read or Not To Read. We'll see you next week.